I think falafel would be something that would definitely be on my menu. Now the thing is, falafel is actually a very very simple dish but to get it absolutely right and the right kind of crisp, you need to do the right kind of method. So you have to soak your chickpeas overnight in water and you don't boil it. When you press it, it kind of breaks but it does not disintegrate. For that to happen, you need to run it through a mixer. This is the kind of breakage that you are looking for. Now this is the right consistency. Here is jalapeno and garlic. 3 heaped tablespoons of parsley. 4 heaped tablespoons of mint. 4 heaped tablespoons of fresh coriander. Half a teaspoon of zira powder. Half a teaspoon of garam masala. Half a tablespoon of za'atar. Half a teaspoon of coriander powder. Half a teaspoon of sumac. Two handfuls onions chopped. We are just going to pulse this because this is all already chopped. In the attempt to mix this all together in the mixie, you over, over mix it and then the chickpeas become, you know, all mush. And that's not what you're looking for. You're looking for that little grainy consistency. And so I like to do it this way. Into my chickpeas, two tablespoons of all-purpose flour, half a teaspoon of baking powder. We just need to mix this together. Salt. Yeah. One. You need to see that the oil is really hot. Otherwise, what sometimes happens is that it disintegrates. And here it is. Be very hot at the moment. Falafel. How beautiful. Crispy on the outside, put the flavor on the inside. If I had a cafe, this would definitely be on my menu.